That's the sound of the good old days. This is a 2003 MacBook, and that's the sound I came to like over the years. Even though this is a 17 years old MacBook, you don't have to go that far back to listen to the distinctive booting chime of the Macs. It is only in 2016 that Apple started to ship its computers with that sound disabled, but it is still there within the operating system. It only needs to be enabled with a very simple command line in the terminal application of macOS. Let me show you how to do it. All right, so here I have the common lines that you need to type in in the terminal. So let's open up terminal and let's type in, actually, I'm just gonna copy this and paste it. So it's command C for copy and let's go back to the terminal window and let's press command V for paste. All right. So let's now press enter. Type in your password, the one you use to log in, uh, in your computer and then press enter and that's done. Now we should be ready to go. And uh, now we should have the chime at the initial uh, boot of the laptop. So I'm just, I'm just gonna close this off. I'm gonna close this off too, and I'm gonna stop recording. Now let's see if it works. So let's open this up. Yes, it does work. Excellent. There is also one other thing I don't like about these uh, MacBooks that uh, came out starting from 2016. And that's the fact that every time you open them up, every time you lift uh, the screen, the computer starts itself. And I do not like that. I like to have uh, the uh, possibility of opening up my MacBook and having the laptop off. So let's go back to terminal and do that as well. All right, so let's go back to terminal and let's type in this command to disable the auto boot, okay? Let's copy this and go back to terminal and paste it. Press enter and your password. And there you are, it's done. Okay, let's test if the command line works. All right, so now it shouldn't boot and it doesn't boot because it shows us the battery icon. And so I'm just gonna press the on button. Let's see. Well, it's not working. Let's press it longer. Yeah, it's working. Okay, now we have done the chime, the initial chime, and we also have uh, the possibility of choosing whether we want to turn the laptop on or leave it off for cleaning, for example. Now, if you want to go back to the way it was, so if you want to disable the comments that you just enabled, you just key in the following um, lines, following comments. So if you want the chime off, type in this one, all right? And if you want the auto boot on, type in this one. And I will link all of these comments in the description of the video, all right? All right, folks, I hope you have enjoyed this video tutorial and that it helps you overcome that nostalgia for the old school Macintosh startup chime. 
That is it for now. Thanks for watching and uh, see you later.